Now, everything I do, they feel sorry for me. They're like, oh, bless. She's going out. <laughs> I remember um, being in Marks and Spencer's like, a couple of days before, walking about and thinking, these people don't know that I'm going to do stand-up. Like, it just felt like a really massive thing. You know, I didn't even know there was a way that you could do that. Well, hey, hello, everyone. Hello. Uh, I'm Janet, lovely to be here tonight. I had a dream, actually, that I did an open mic, and I told my boyfriend, he went, well, why don't you do it? And I said, oh, don't be silly. You know, I'm not that funny. And he said, well, you are. I'll give it a go. You only live once, don't you? But the first gig I did was October 2014, so I would have been 53. People did laugh a bit, and I didn't forget what I was saying, didn't run off crying, stayed up there, did the five minutes, and came out of there sort of walking on air. It is scary. I'm not going to say it's not scary, because it is scary. You know, the first hundred times you do it, it is scary. He went, oh, he went, aren't you aggressive for an older lady? <laughs> oh, I know. I went, are you calling a lady? You get, especially young guys, they look and, mm, you know, they sort of cringe because it could be their mum. I don't talk about maybe what people would expect you to talk about at this age. You get up, it's the older one, they think, oh, she's not going to be funny, she's going to be talking about the washing up or the ironing or boring. And they expect you to be all nicey or to talk about hot flushes. I hope that I'm not what people would expect. Two daughters, yeah, 15 and 18. <laughs> you just don't want to embarrass your kids, really. They didn't not like me doing it, but they've never been to see me, never. Um, and they find it a little bit embarrassing, which I suppose, you know, it's like your mum. Um, showing off and swearing. You don't want to be an embarrassment to your kids, do you? I said, babe, I'm so sorry you feel like that. I said, now put the wine bottle down, <laughs> get up off the floor, <laughs> wipe the sick out your ear. <laughs> My dad was really funny, a really funny man and we watched a lot of comedy growing up. I, I do think my dad might go, who do you think you are getting up doing that? But that might be my hang up. You should try things because life is short and you only get one bash at it, don't you? Thank you very much.